Hi there, this is a recording about getting Vanilla to play back selective instruments on repeats. So I've set this up so that the first time you'll hear only drums, the second time the bass will enter, and the third time the chords will enter. So the way this is done is with commands <clears throat> that are given MIDI commands, and there's two ways to do it, with either key velocities or with um, volume commands in MIDI. So what you can do is you can make either a visible or invisible um, expression. So I'll, I'll do the visible one. So I say do the expression tool. I double click where I want the um, note to the, the first part of the thing to be to be muted and then I created in miscellaneous um, and I just decided to use the wording enter second time and then you go to um, you get this window and then you go to playback and you tell it key velocity and you set it to zero and play only on pass one and what that will do is it will start it off as muted then you go to the second time, you have to create another um, expression that you also attach to the first note of the passage where you tell it to start playing and so that's where you might say whatever it is, enter second time or um, you know uh, something like that, begin playing on third pass or whatever you want to say and then for that one you uh, tell it to you put the velocity at a higher level that, that it will make it play back and you have that play on pass 2 or 3 or whenever you want it to enter um, so that's the way you do it with key velocities if you do it with um, uh, the volume uh, function I think that's what I did with this one let's see no, that's key velocity too but the way you would do it with volume is you would you would go to controller and choose the volume number seven and you would set it to zero for mute and then when you want it to enter you'd set it for a number to enter. So either way you can get it to um, play you know be muted on a first time or a second time or however many times and then enter on the second time, third time, fourth time, whatever you say. Now sometimes if you don't want to put in all these words, you can also do one that's uh, blank. Here's a blank one. In other words, I, I just created a... I didn't create any words, I just kept it blank. Or you could make a tiny little symbol like a little period or something that's very hard to see. And then you go here and you give it your command. And so you could put that in as well, and then that way you don't have to always have a lot of words if the words are taking up too much space, or of course you can make the words smaller. So that's the way it's done. And you have to be aware that <clears throat> with MIDI instruments, all of this stuff works. With um, sample instruments like Garrison sounds, sometimes the on certain instruments in the sample library, the um, key velocity command won't work. But in those cases, then using the MIDI controller 7 for volume will work. So between those two methods, you can get the, uh, get the job done.